the Shostakovich first violin concerto is one of the most dark and emotional and also in many ways uh, haunting pieces in the repertoire. Uh, already in the first movement there's such uh, there's a you can really feel the kind of desolation that people would have felt in the time uh, under Joseph Stalin when this was written and he actually kept it um, just in a away in a, in a drawer f uh, for a long time until Stalin died and only then was it performed um, it also has those the second and fourth movement that those types of very typical Shostakovich movements that are uh, frantic and relentless and it, again it reflects maybe his feelings of being a cog in the sort of machine of the Soviet Union um, uh, I think the, mo the greatest uh, for me the greatest part of the of the concerto and the reason why I like to play it so much is the third movement which is a passacaglia which means that the, there's a bass line that gets repeated over and over it's the type of thing that um, was very common in Baroque music and you know Bach does this and um, and it's very, very dramatic and emotional. Um, and at the end of the third movement, there is a huge cadenza for the for the violin alone. One of the longest cadenzas probably in the violin repertoire, and one of the most exciting. It just goes crazy and crazy and crazy and crazier, and you completely go nuts on stage. And it goes straight into the last movement, and it's one of the most probably one of the most exciting things uh, uh, a violinist could do on stage: is play this is <laughs> play this moment in this piece.